Hey, before starting, I would like to excuse with my subscribers if recently I didn't publish a video, but it was very busy. Now, today I will show you a very strange experiment, purificating calcium phosphate, that is to say, tricalcium phosphate, from animal bones. Warning, hydrochloric acid is corrosive and ammonia gas is all toxic. Please work outside or in a few minutes. Let's start. To begin, we need 200 grams of animal bones. They must be very, very old, or it will be present in the final product, a consistent quantity of organic material, and useful to us. Now, crush the bones containing calcium phosphate with an hammer into very small pieces. If the neighbors will complain because of the noise, tell them it's my fault. When it's done, add the bones into an elf leather beaker. Then, add the 200 grams of 30% hydrochloric acid carefully and let it rest for about 4 or 5 days. The reaction occurring is the following. Hydrochloric acid reacts with calcium phosphate to give in solution calcium chloride and calcium hydrogen phosphate. After, add other 115 grams of hydrochloric acid and heat the solution on an hot plate or a burner to about 70-80 degrees. With the heat, the reaction will proceed in fact faster and faster. After about one hour, stop the heating and filtrate. About the filtration, I suggest you to use a vacuum filtration apparatus. If you haven't got it, the filtration will be long, less in between two and three days. But you don't need to stay away for all this time, on the contrary, there are many things to do in the meantime. Asking a girl to go out, going with her to the cinema. Now, for the last part of the reaction, prepare a 5% ammonia solution by adding 96 mm of 28% ammonia to 570 mm of distilled water. I suggest you not to use 5% commercial ammonia, since other components usually present in it could change the reaction. Once the filtration of the solution containing hydrochloric acid and bones is done, with a pH paper control the pH and dilute with water the orange-brown solution till the pH is slowly acid, about 4 or 5. If you haven't got pH paper, it can be bought online. When you're ready, add the orange solution to the ammonia one. Calcium triphosphate precipitates instantly. This is the reaction with the right quantity of ammonia. But since we had an ammonia large excess, the equilibrium is moved to left and calcium triphosphate precipitates. Here you can see the precipitate better. Now you have to filtrate your product and I tell you that also this filtration will be very slow. Obviously you have also to let it dry for about 1, 2, 3 days. This is the final product, about 40 grams of tricalcium phosphate. This product got here will be used in an upcoming video for phosphoric acid synthesis, so keep following my channel. Thank you for your attention.